No, just simply exploring and adventuring with Lewis and Hannah today. And we're coming to you from Bidditz Fire Nights Festival. Uh, this is day one, the first night. Uh, it's going to run for 10 days. Um, they're only going to have certain uh, uh, sculptures out each night and uh, vendors and stuff like that. So, um, so let's ready and let's go. Oh, the bobsled, yeah. Cool. Lancaster General Health. BMW. Yeah, USA. It's a bobsled. Yeah, USA bobsled. Yeah. It's cool. I'm walking around. Do I have powder on my face? I can't tell. I don't think so. Oh, wow. Cool. It's like a dragon. Chinese dragon. Chinese New Year. Because of the Chinese New Year. Yep. Going on. They did that for that. Dragon breath? Come on. Focus. Oh, there's his bobsled. Oh. There's a trash. Bye bye, Dusty. I got two more weeks. Penn State Health. Bye bye, Duckies. Come on, step back. Ah, that's why. I had it on normal. Uh, set it on wide. Is that all the extra ice behind the sculpture? Yeah. When they shave it, they have to cut out chunks of it. Uh, let's see what this is. And then we'll head up that way. Look at these things. Nah, goods auto. Two wrenches. Oh, you know what they don't have this year? The chair. They, usually the chair was right over there. Might have it another day too. Roars, Corey. Do you have it until next weekend? Um, yes, 10 days. And I was doing the same. I was in his Sorry. Like, I was not. No. So, he started talking to the guy over here. Oh, we missed that one down there. There's a sculpture over there by the tomato pie. That's okay. I don't need to get them all. I'm, the, I'm trying to, like, oh. I don't want to walk all across the street and then come back over here again. Oh, we got one right here. Purpley. Oh, it's their logo, uh, North Star, North Group. Times, yeah, they. Right. It's pretty much every year they. Every year they pretty much. All right. They have the star of the north, the north. But it's mutual. Let's see what the the big one here at that it's mutual is. Usually they have a very nice one. Actually, this is the one they actually normally would do a a live. Um, carving demo with and the local uh, news station is always here capturing it so maybe they did already I'm not sure well, let's see what it oh it looks like the sun Took a toll on it today too. Darn. It's 
Hard to see what it says. Oh, wow. Oh, I see hearts. They do different things every year. Uh, yeah, that was last year or the year before. That was beautiful. It's hard to see, but it does say something on there. The light, the way the light's hitting it, it's kind of hard. And with the sun beating down on it. There you are. I'm like, where are you? Your side me. And the fire company is down that way, and the police police station is right across the street too. So, huh? What? Yeah, no, I see them. We're coming back around. Remember? Two bears. Young Men's Business League. 1914. And then it's police. Still having to put, oh, here's one. What do we got? Oh, the pagoda again. <laughs> we got another pagoda again. I don't know why my picture quality is looking grainy, but hopefully the pictures turn out better. <coughs> Illusion, yes. I want to go in there. It was, uh, it was the old uh, shirt factory. T-shirt factory. It's now called Collusion something. And they're supposed to be... Uh, um, photo photographic display or something. Local photographers and stuff like that. Dang. Hold it. <laughs> and I know usually <coughs> we turn and cross the street right here because I don't think there's anything beyond here. And uh, as I stated, normally there'd be a lot more, but because of the COVID situation still, they decided to extend it into a 10-day um, event. Normally, this is only like a three to four day event, but they're extending it. Um, and we're going to turn here. And in there... This is a former church. Now it's a private home. Inside in there, um, when JP Videos came and brought his family and did, you know, walked around town, he looked in, peeked into one of the windows thinking it was still a church. And when he looks in it, there was uh, two cars, classic cars, sitting in the middle of the living room, I guess, or whatever. Wow. 45s. Not CD. Do you mean D? This is how I used to listen to music when I first came. Really? These are 45s. Before, way before CDs. You would need a record player. Yeah. And you only had like, most of the time you only had one song on each side. What? Yeah. Dragon? You can dragon in front of this Oh, cool. Dragon. Sorry. <laughs> oh, cool. Is that a bowl? Um, Oleo oils and balsamic. That sounds like a bowl or something. Bowl of, almost bowl of fire. <laughs> That's what it looks like. Yeah. Maybe 
Maybe it is. And then this is an oil shop in Balsamics. Like I said, so we probably won't see as many won't see as many uh, ice sculptures right now. And the weather's supposed to get a little bit warmer during the week, so hopefully a lot of these won't melt badly. That's why I like coming the first night, because usually it's, uh, it's the best night to come out, because it's Usually one of, one of the coldest nights, too. Oh, wow. Yep. Hot with wings. <laughs> he realized I was filming, so he said hi. <laughs> Hello. Dragonfly. Uh, tattered shirt, cool. They have their own shop now. That it's rocks. And then I looked and I saw through the alley. There it is. This is the old uh, shirt factory. Now it's called Collusion. Oh, what happened here? Oh man, it broke. There's two pieces over there. Oh well, uh, yeah. Oh man, it's a shame. Yeah, I hope no one needed. But here's what's left of what was supposed to be a castle or something. There's a. And then this is a what? Oh, tap works. It's a place that has uh beer and stuff like that so oh but this used to be this building right here used to be an old shirt factory at one time yeah yep. actually it does say t-shirt factory on the side on the side yeah Yep, it does say cheese. Shirt factory on the side, okay. Yeah, this is the old. Yeah, well, this is not a ghost. This is a, a, a new one. But they sell beer and stuff like that in there. You just put, but it's awesome to see it repurposed again. Mmm, something seafoodish. Yep. So you can see, uh, it's, yeah, that's the other half of it. So you just, so, I don't know. I think somebody might have kicked it. Watch. I think somebody kicked it too. So it looks like. Looks like someone's like. Ubiquitous. <laughs> they sell all the knitting. Stuff and yarns and all that stuff. Yarn smith. That's cool. And like I said, there's the headquarters of the Lidditz Police Department and uh, Lidditz offices and council chambers. Borrowed the borough offices. Yeah, it's. I am so, so uh, uh, not upset, but I thought they would have kept this with its original name. Uh, oh, the penguins. Penguins like hearts. Yeah. Alright, perfect. Thank you very much. Trying to get it. Got it. Thank you. Barley Snyder. They saw. Oh, there's the ice bar. <laughs> there's the ice bar right there. So, 
beer and stuff. Yeah, pretty much. And there's the ice bar. Yeah. I said, I guess mostly because of COVID. COVID, even though most people you see are unmasked, most people should have their vaccines and stuff. Um, they had to change the format this year. Hopefully within the next few years, year or two, maybe by next year it'll, it'll come go back to its normal operation. Yeah. Usually right here they have the lidits. Look at this lidits. Got it, thank you. <laughs> oh, sorry. Like I said, there's the Bull's Head, famous Bull's Head Tavern, public house. It's a bar, yeah, and restaurant, I think, too. Yeah, it's a bar and restaurant. I wouldn't know. I've never ate in there, but it could be. Yeah, reminds me of uh, I mean, from what I've seen, uh, the British pubs. And I like coming here to Samanka Alley. Oh, they don't have the heat the heat things on today. Yeah. Yeah. I haven't been in here in a while. I love this art. I wish I could buy one. Yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. I mean, here, this one. used to be the old uh, newspaper building. I just really wish I could get a small oh, I love going in, thing. looking in there. It's called the Zumanko Alley Shops. Oh, there's one here. Fish. <laughs> Want to go yeah, I've been in here. Oh my god, there's a plane. Huh? The little hot air balloon looking mm -hmm. one. Oh, oh, they're cool. Look at that. They sell these in there. I wish we could get them. Oh, bags. wow. Look how beautiful they are. There's the other one. It looks like, it looks like beautiful. a hot air balloon. That's cool. I got a picture of the fish already. The mannequin there, though. Yeah, I know. I haven't been in here. Like I said, this was the old uh, newspaper building, I believe. Or is it that one over there? No, this is the old newspaper building. Upstairs, they have stuff from when it was a newspaper. I got one. I got one of mine back, and it's not real or silk, airplane, soul sucker, five dollars. Huh? Hello. Oh, tell me, this is the, the place. Yes. I ha I got it a few years back and I lost it. Well, and it was and I, I and I actually made it at home myself. Oh, good, good. Yeah, try. you can well, try it. I think I have a little non-alcohol glass. Yeah. Would you like to try? It's it has yeah. the same taste. Right? Okay. So I think you're probably going to be my last one out of this one. <laughs> okay. Yes. Man, I've been very lucky today. I couldn't remember what the ingredients were and, I, and where I got oh, really? it from. Yeah. Okay. It's it just. I love this place, all the pieces. I think this is your lucky day. I'm going to let you try this one, okay? Okay, sure. So we're at our first sculpture, that it's golf, and it's at the pocket there. Okay, we're going to walk. 
There's a few more this way. Lancaster County Podiatry is right here nearby. I think we're walking on Main Street here. Garmin Builders. We got a big old boot, can't you tell? Cowboy boot. Wow, I know you can't tell. Oh wow, the ice cream shop is closed today. Oh, close for the season. Okay. Who wants ice cream on a, on a cold day, right? And then you hear more of the historic area, the Moravian area. The Moravian house is also right here near, near here. I've never the, ones here, the one time the one time we went here yeah. they were selling <laughs> snow cones. They re uh, like, yeah. repurposed them now for offices, but there's a lot of historic buildings here in in this area. Uh, that's the Pilger house right across the way. And this is the Moravian house, Antiques and Treasures. What? We should have stopped at Sheets and got us all some cappuccino. Yeah. yeah. I didn't, didn't think, think about, about it. That, did nope. You? I did not think about it. Neither did I until now. And then uh, we've been to the museum right here across the street as well a few years back. But I'm going to have to come and revisit again. Let's see. Uh, Sculpt, ice sculpture up here and then we're probably gonna turn around unless further up I think it's is the pretzel place so this is the Moravian buildings and they explained that a lot of in these a lot of these buildings um, the men and women lived separately in separate buildings. A wolf? I think that's what it is. That's what it looks like. Linden Hall for Girls is right over there. <laughs> that so that's supposed to be like a wolf? I think so. Yeah, it is. A wolf or a dog? Let's see. Looks like it's supposed to be like a. We'll find out shortly. A lion or something. Hmm. It's hard to tell. I can't tell. I don't know if there's anything uh, further down this way. But we'll look a little bit more. Because in the past, I haven't explored down this way yet. We, we usually. Yeah, we usually go, go more toward the uh, center of the square and down toward Little Springs Park. Um, they haven't been having a lot like they used to. Um, yeah, Sturgis, I thought so. Sturgis Pretzels is right over there. That it's as... Uh, no... Yep, there's Linden Girls for Linden Linden Hall for Girls. It's an all girls school. Oh wow. By the Moravian Church. Oldest school. So we're gonna cross shortly and go by Sturgis Pretzels. Or we might just go up to the end of the block here and come back around. This is actual Linden Hall. So this is the actual school. Well, the church is part of it too as well. But this is the actual school. It's a private all-girls school. The only one in our area that I... To my knowledge... Yep. Actually, I don't think I'm going to go all the way down. I think I'm just going to...
across the street shortly here at the corner here and then this is part of the in the hall campus here hello yep these are the part of the rest of the campus here so we are going to turn around right well across the street here at this uh, driveway and go back the other way toward uh, Sturgis Pretzels but there's a lot of historic buildings here in town so we're gonna go here to the cross crosswalk so I'm not sure if that's Linden Hall or not out of Linden Hall but there's a lot of historic buildings here we're kind of doing a, like a little loop that way when we go back to, to the car whatever we didn't catch on the way out here we'll catch on the way back toward the car Uh-huh, I told you. Put them in your pocket. That's I am it. keeping them in my pocket. Yeah, so am I. I'm, I'm switching... Switching, uh... I wish I had gold. Yeah, I didn't think about that, too, to grab mine, just in case. Because the one Eagles pair that I have um, has the, the finger that's touch-sensitive on these screens. So... Stairs and decided to come up to the second floor now. My favorite area is this area over here. Yeah. I love the little sitting area as well. I love how they have like a sitting area. Love the proud resident of Pennsylvania. I just like how they have like a sitting area. Mm hmm. Police Department, Lancaster. <laughs> cool. Wow. I love how they have furniture because it makes you feel a little homey and stuff. Yeah. Don't get too comfortable. Don't get too comfortable. Yeah, I know. Don't get too comfortable. Don't get too comfortable. Yeah, I know. They just want you to stay a spell. But you still get too comfortable. Yeah. And this is some of my favorite things here. The old letter blocks from the when they used to do the printing. They don't have it anymore, but they used to have an actual printing press thing here at one time. So either somebody bought it or something happened. Mm -hmm. They used to have like a little the, that round plate where they did the actual printing. But I don't see it any longer. The little table right here. Mm-hmm. That Antique. is the... By now, I'll pick up what you were doing. The little photos mm -hmm. from the <laughs> This house is ridiculously merry. <laughs> so it still has a little bit of that Christmassy feeling here and there. And that's the other bathroom and there's an office in there love the double door they um oh, I forgot what they call that Dutch doors I think they are I think so so it was the it's record express this was the old my favorite area this place is alrighty now we just came from the Manker Alley this was the old Zook's bookstore, main pet street peddler's call. It's an antique shop. And then this is Laura the Cookie Lady's shop. And one of my favorite places where I have that I love. Uh, is zest. I love listening to him he play the guitar. It's actually him. We were watching the live mannequin there.
I love listening to him every every year we come. Every year we come. Well, this last year there was also another guy here too. So yeah, it was a different guy. Well, he was there, but he they take turns, I guess. Oh, they saw like appliances and stuff. Yeah. Go ahead, you can go through. I am recording. That it's as famous for that Moravian star too. So you'll see you'll see that on on the porches of a lot of homes here. And here's the world famous Julius Sturgis pretzels. Oh yeah. Why is it upside down? <laughs> Actually, if you look at it, it it replicates the sign. Looks just oh. like the sign. Oh, but see, here's the. Replacement. Yeah, That's I know. Like. Yeah. But their sign is uh, it has it upside down, the twists. That's weird. Yeah. Yeah, that's interesting. Oh, there's like a, here, wait, there's like a shadow. Yes, I don't oh, he's both of you. Yep. And then there's the big giant pretzel. Your dog's so cute. Oh, thank you. <laughs> he's all excited. We're walking a different way. He doesn't know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> it is on the... National Register of Historic Places. Did you ever go there? Where? Yeah. Nope. Oh, that's, that's a cool place to go. I, yeah. used to, I, I don't live here anymore, but I used to live in Lidditz. Um, oh. You can take the tour there and make your own pretzel. Yeah. My sister came a few years ago from New York, but I, I live in Lancaster. But Yeah, the um, Sturgis pretzels are like the best hard pretzels. Hard pretzels. Oh, pretzels. So I'm more of a soft they, pretzel well, fan. They, but. Well, they sell soft pretzels there too, but the hard pretzels are really good. Ah, uh, yeah. I know that's what they're more famous for. So as you can hear, uh, as you just heard, uh, some other folks were there taking pictures as well, and they recommend doing the tour. I have never done the tour myself, but I plan to. Some of these cool, beautiful homes. Oh, cool, it's lit up now. I didn't see it earlier. They didn't have the lights up on it. Now it's lit up in green. I'm gonna have to go get another picture of it. Really quick. Yeah, earlier the light wasn't on yet. That's a lot. Sorry. <laughs> I got distracted. Sorry. 
I said I'm just gonna go to get another picture of it, that's it. Because it's lit up now. So thankfully the first this is the uh, museum I was talking about. Thankfully the temperature has dropped to keep those uh, sculptures. It's called the Johannes Mueller House. And then you go through there to the garden and stuff. And I know during the summer months they do uh, they do uh, reenactments and everything. And the uh, Lidditz Historical Foundation is also here. So because I didn't think to bring my gloves, I'm having a switch constantly they look so beautiful lit up now and a lot of these as you can see there's pilger house again and we're on this side of the street now we came from that side just around the corner there by the path carry I'm having to um, switch hands constantly because I've also forgot to bring my selfie stick, which it didn't matter because I would have I would have had to. Uh... See now the lights are on, but it's hard to see. I like to see them lit up with the with the lights. But when we walked by earlier. The lights weren't on on, on the uh, sculptures yet, but you'll see more. We're, we've been coming here now, what, three, four years now, right, Hannah? Yeah. This is, I think, our fourth year. And the post office always has a beautiful one, Lank. Oh, cool, it has the Lank. Instead of Validics, they have one anyway. Oh, there must be a sculpture here, yep. Yeah. Oh, out of 79 house. So this building has been repurposed. It's a Yes. <laughs> oh, Stolen Wolf. Oh. I got like a Ham it up. Yeah. They're hamming it up. <laughs> and the lighting on on this one either, but it's cool. Stolen wolf. Sugar whip bakery. There's a pizza shop, Nino's. I wonder if they have the uh, oh they got two sculptures over there now ah oh. oh, candiology yeah it's candiology usually I bring my daughters here on their birthday to get their candy huh oh wow cool that sun, that sun beating on our roller today. Oh. Right. Yeah. We're going to start getting to it, the sun. Yeah. It's on our roller today. Oh, man. Yep. And it's beating on it, so it's not as, not as clear. Yeah. Yeah, it started melting a little bit. And some of these buildings have a little plaque. Of what they were before to what they are now. A lot of it has been repurposed, like I said. I like poodles, so that's a cute dog. More in furniture. And there's the olden house over there. And there's another building here. Of the I have to just get the and get the two rocking chairs here. Oh, excuse me.
And like it says, welcome to Lidditz. Sweet Legacy. It's another bake shop, candy shop. There's Roma Pizza. This is new Piccolo Eatery. Oh, they got cannolis in there. Well, the shelves for the cannolis, so I guess they fill them once that you put the order in. And then the, the tiger's eye. Huh? Okay. Where we're cut off at, but I'm going again. There's. There's the Piper's Bell Barbecue. Nodjaw. The beef jerky bacon. It's like a, I think this is the one that's like the big slab of, it's like a big slab of bacon. Nodjaw, yeah. Yeah. Oh, the grill is not working. Well, he's cooking right now. Good, buddy. It smells good. Mm, it's like the, like a thick slab of bacon. Watch. Yeah. On a stick. Yeah, that's what they're making right there. <laughs> it's bacon, basically. Thick bacon. Oh, I'm sure it does. It smells like it's seasoned. Yeah, I'm sure they put something on there. Maybe their own special blend, for all we know. And like anything else, it's going to have large lines right now because of being a festival as well. What? Crab cakes. We're going to head back out. Well, their uh, funnel cakes are much bigger. That's why. Bucky's, kettle corn. Yeah, now we're going across the street. Yeah, I don't know if they do that anymore. Years ago, they used to do a, a fire fire display up here right on the pond so, oh let's go <laughs> yeah the f i think the first year we came it was just mostly the sculptures and uh, they would have these the warming state yeah i didn't even see the heat tunnel over there usually on the main street there's the rolex clock and then here's the uh train station We've been in here before. I don't know if you want to. We want to go in again. I'm not sure we're allowed with the food in there. Yeah. So this is the uh, old train station. They are open. I'm not sure if the one of the caboose is open today. And now, so you would have waited right here, and then the train would have came over there. Oh, I was about to say, is it closed? Oh yeah, we it's changed a little bit, I guess. Have to go back around. So <laughs> here's the rest of the Wilbur chocolate. Now it's a fancy restaurant down in the bottom, and. Uh, And they have a little bit of uh, railroad history in there. Oh, yeah, no kidding. It's gonna get cold. Mine is probably f frozen. <laughs> I had a, a bite of it already. <laughs> Let's see if the. Oh no, the caboose is not open this year. Darn, I was hoping. To... This has always been a treat for me. But the caboose is not open this year. 
normally they would and you can go in there and sit up in the in the cupola and everything but it's it's closed this year darn it the picture of the uh, tracks yeah like I said normally they would have this open today but this is the caboose museum I told you. I can't feel the cold. I can't even feel my fingers anymore, little by little. At least my every single yeah. And Matthew's thrift shop is already closed. I was gonna come by earlier. Maybe we could have found ourselves some uh, some gloves. I could definitely see you burning it while it's on Timmy. Whoa! Whoa! Hello. No, that's more Timmy style. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, what is this? Like, five grand Timmy style? There's Roma Pizza. Something I can't have too much of anymore. Because, oh, I can have thin crust. That's about it. Thin crust pizza. Is it? It affects my sugar. Oh, cool. Let me see. Mm -hmm. We're not allowed to go in there. Mm. Alden House. Like anything else, you get in, you get into it what you put into it. Uh, you get out of it what you put into it. Sorry. I Sorry. And then uh, here's probably our final stop for the night. In the uh, post office as usual. Usually it's one of our first ones, but doing your birthday. <laughs> really? Really? Yeah. I remember I brought you here last year for You're your birthday. You're gonna do it again? Yeah. Can we go to Edwards' candies? Yeah, I know you. I know you want to go to Edwards' as well. Trying to figure out what it is from here. Yeah. Diner trap. We already did it. Trying to figure out what it is, but. Okay. Diner trap. Why the heck is he I think we only missed one so far this year. Like I said, I don't know how many more they're going to put out, but I had to definitely get this one because. We are from Lank. Silver sponsor. Yeah, I know. Everybody's waiting to cross. <laughs> I think I'm. I hit the wrong one. I mean, Yep. Oh, sorry about that. Got it. No worry. Thank you. Okay, they are. They have some of the vendors here. Normally, they used to be on the main street here, off to the side, but um, now they have them all over there. But we'll have a look after we get our our uh, funnel cake here. Yeah, they do. They do the nibs. They do? I would love to. Try you gotta go inside and get, a nib. get the nibs. Funnel cake. Yes. Oh my God. I gotta get changed, though. Do you want some right now? Huh? Do you want some right now? What? Funnel Do you want some right now? Okay, well, I don't know how long they're gonna be out here. So let's go into the 
we'll restore really quick. And then we'll come back and get some. Ooh, what are they? What are they making here? Oh, what is she making? Oh, that looks so good. It's um uh, stroop waffle. Sure. Yes. <laughs> yeah. They're so good. Absolutely. <laughs> Stroop waffles. Stroop are so waffles. Good. They're so good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You're in Lancaster, aren't you? We are. Yeah. Thank you. Mm. And they're nice and hot. And oh, man, they're nice and fresh and warm. Yes, you're just for the best. Mm. Yeah. Oh my god. Is that hot chocolate? Yeah. Yep. I'm just going to get my hand a little warm here. So this is now we're inside the Wilbur store. But there used to be that Gatley somewhere, but I'm not sure what they do now. So, a little bit of showing the Wilbur Chocolate Legacy. The building across the street, the old factory where Wilbur was at. It can be, depends what you get. The buds. Especially like these things. I know the buds used to be up here, the samples. Yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. I know they used to have the buds back here. I don't know. This is the actual kitchen. They do all year, all occasion candy. Uh -huh. Memorabilia. Cool. He's actually right now in the process of wrapping him up. Cool. For Easter. They have like the free bracelet things. Wow. They have free glow sticks. Oh wow, cool. You want, you want a good glow stick if you want to? Okay. See what color it comes out. Or... Hard to figure out which way to go. Well, I don't see the nib samples. They used to do nib nib samples. But I don't see them right now. I don't know why. Uh, Oh, yeah. Yep. Okay, so this is the actual retail store now. And I don't see the, the free names anymore. I don't think they do them anymore. Because of COVID, I know that's why. Oh, wow. No, because of COVID. Yeah. 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 No. 125 years ago. So the old Wilbur chocolate factory is across the street. And, uh. How much are they? That's not too bad. Oh, that's the note cards. Okay. How much are the actual. Um. How much are the, uh... Yeah, I forgot Pretzel Fest is coming up. It's $25 you can have all the pretzel samples you want. I mean, when they do it in April. Yeah. 
Jeez. Oh, wow, yeah. Wow. Cool, I gotta get a picture of that. For display purpose. Oh, wow, yeah. Holy. Okay. And this was the machine that would crush the cocoa. So, unfortunately, they're not doing the samples right now. Um, just want to get my hands a little warm. Huh? You want hot cocoa? Yeah, no. Tiger's Eye has the uh, the bunny. Oh, almost missed his ears. He is partly lit up, but it's hard to see. Thank you. Yeah. I like how every year they change the... It was a bunny rabbit. <laughs> Still has its Christmas vibe, still somewhat. Yes, I saw it. It looks nice. This town area looks really pretty at night. Hey, I don't hear the guitar guy. Oh, he's okay. I think you have to stand in front of the as zest. Usually, yep, there's a guy at the. He's always the same guy, I think, every year. Yep, but you got to stand right at the door to hear the music. Yeah, now I hear it. But we usually stop there anyway. Oh, man. This one got damaged. Oh, man. Charis. It's for you. Oh, the Olympic rings. Cool. Yeah, from the sun beating on it this earlier today. Tide house. Man, this is nice. It, Clementines. Yeah. A lot of new shops here that have opened since last year. Cherry Acres. I love the, 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 the chimeneas. I would love to own one. They have a sale. Yeah. 20% off of the chimeneas. Which means chimneys in Spanish. It's a Mexican chim Mexican chimney. Yeah, we got smaller chimneys. I just want to see what the price is on it. Whew, two hundred fifty-four dollars. <laughs> oh wow, music here. Bunny, Bunyad Marketplace. Magic carpet. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep. They got carpets in the back. Pairs. Bull's head. Okay. All righty. And there's the uh, Bull's Head Tavern and the Little Spring Hotel now, which. Um, had its name changed from the it used to be the Sutter Inn, General Sutter Inn, but because of um, issues with him having owned slaves, you know, they asked to have his name taken off of it and going back to its original name which was the Little Springs Hotel before and if you don't know anything about General Sutter uh, he has an interesting past General Sutter was sort of responsible for the the gold rush and he went out there to go make his money 
Yay! Riptide car wash. Race car. Riptide car wash. Not lit up, but maybe I can give it some color splash. <laughs> color spot it. <laughs> yeah. If they have it, I don't know. My daughter Hannah's looking forward to. Uh, usually, there's a Boy Scout troop right up the road here by um by the chocolate. By the Wilbur Chocolate Store. I couldn't think of the name of the place. Um, and we are walking right by Little Springs Park, but we will be doing the loop, like I said, and going into the park, see what's there. There's a tomato pie cafe. Huh? Oh. They're selling stuff here. Mm. Hot chocolate, molten chocolate ganache. Ooh. Oh my gosh! Something you want to get? I was thinking about it. The ganache. It's like a melted chocolate they put right over the top of the cake. Oh. They have it. Oh. They have it. No, that's not them. No. That's not them. The, the Boy Scout troop is over there. They they do have them. They're over there. Oh wow. This is gonna be hard to do. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I really wanna take Spanish, but I also think I should take German. This is really gonna be hard to take pictures here with everybody.